The temporal bone has an external auditory meatus. This is how the vibrations of sound enter the auditory canal and reach the middle and inner ears where the sound is processed. The temporal bone has an internal auditory meatus where the vestibulocochlear nerve then transmits information about sound, balance, and acceleration to the brain. In between these two is where the middle and inner ear are located. This is actually within the temporal bone. So there is a cavity within the temporal bone which holds the middle and inner ear. And the middle ear includes three tiny bones, the malleus, the incus, and the stapes, which amplify the vibrations of sound. These are located within the temporal bone. Two of these bones, the malleus and incus, are only known in mammals. As mammals reorganized the jaw and developed a new jaw joint, two small ancestral bones were then no longer needed in the jaw and were incorporated in the middle ear. In human fetuses, these bones form in the vicinity of the jaw and are incorporated into the middle ear.